Hey, uh, Corey, um, congratulations on uh, not just the game, but your career too. And then um, can you talk about the uh, putting the pressure on them? Uh, uh, Coach Lempa said you guys started out a little soft on purpose just to s see what was going on, because especially since they had all these different quarterbacks who might have played. And then you guys really put the heat on. And then also the importance for the to finish out, even though it didn't really matter for the, the win or the loss, to finish out that goal line stand. Um, uh, yeah, I think that's been kind of a, a trend this year. We start off slow, and uh, uh, after those two scores, we all just kind of came together on the sideline and said, all right, enough's enough, let's go. Uh, we, we had a feeling number 12 was going to be playing today. Uh, their scheme was, they had a good scheme. Uh, they made some plays, we made plays. Drew, you took that shot towards the end of the, you know, close to the end of the first half, that hard shove out of. Oh, we got the pup, man. Young pup. Drew, you took that shot out of bounds close to the close to halftime. Did that, you know, what happened on that? Would that fire up the team? What the, what, it, was it the kind of thing you guys needed to, you know, just get the extra momentum, extra fire? Uh, I'm not really sure uh, the purpose it served, but uh, it kind of hurt. And uh, I think that I, after that play, I knew that everyone on the sideline had my back, so. Coach, first year, first bowl game, first championship win as a head coach. Sum up this one for you and the program. I mean, you know, we, we want a happy Ohana, and we're happy to be part of Pride Rock, and we're just one happy family, and we want to thank the fans out there, because you guys are the best, and we couldn't do it without you guys' just aloha and support. I imagine there's more questions. Raise your hand, please. Yeah, Drew, um, you know, you had such a good game to end the regular season, and you continued it tonight. Uh, nine touchdowns, no picks your last two games. Just kind of any idea what the reason is for that, whether you feel more comfortable, whether you're picking things up, or just how do you explain these last two games? Uh, <laughs> I think the, the offensive line played uh, a solid role in that. I think they played very well the past two games, uh, as well as all year. Um, most of the time when the offense isn't, isn't working, it's my fault. Um, but I still think that um, I made some mistakes today, um, but they just weren't magnified. Um, and uh, receivers went out there, played great. Coaches called the right plays. Um, and uh, yeah, I think uh, it's nice to finish the season this way. What about just overall this season for you to, to come in and take over the starting job and finish it off this way for, for this being your first year and with so much more to come, just how do you feel about it right now? Uh, it hasn't really hit me yet, um, but I mean, I'm just grateful for the opportunity that Coach Rollo gave me, uh, taking a shot on me. So um, that's, it hasn't, it still kind of feels surreal. Um, I'm sure I'll have some time for self-reflection on this five hour flight I'm about to take, but uh, just extremely grateful. Uh, Rolo, can you kind of talk about the defense after they gave up those two quick scores? How'd you guys kind of adjust after that? I mean, he asked us to get the kind, the ball back, so we got him tree. The defense was able to get him tree back, so, and they kept fighting, fighting like we, like Max Holloway does. That's how we do it. Corey, how uh, you know did it feel to end your UH career with a win in you know this game, the f first bowl win for this program in ten years? 
Uh, it's uh, amazing, really. Uh, when Coach Rollo came in, uh, we, as a senior group and as a team, we set a goal that we wanted to uh, leave this place. I've said it before, leave this place better than when we came in. And I think Drew, Coach Rollo, all the seniors did a great job this year uh, at doing that. And it's just surreal. Corey, take us back to day one of the Nick Rolovich era. And he's standing up there talking about some rock named Pride that you never heard of and some Lion King. Were you thinking, oh no, it's going to be like that? I just thought to myself, first impression, oh, who's this Holly guy coming in? I watched him when I was little. Man, I was young. He, a young and when uh, watching Coach Rolo play, but you know what? I'm just glad it all worked out. I'm glad he's here and he's going to take this program to new heights. And you guys just sit back and watch. Rolo, you take over. Did you ever imagine a Hawaii Bowl win and a seven and seven record in year one? I, we did, because of the heart of the warrior. He get the kind, the big pride in him. So we got to bring the passion to. Uh, if I have this correct, this is the first game you guys haven't turned it over this year. Drew, talk about that and um, how, how nice is it to end the year that way? Uh, it's nice to end the year that way. Um, I think it's something that that I've struggled with all year. Um, I think we'd, we'd probably have two more wins if, if we just stop turning the ball over in critical situations. Um, and, you know, that's, that's my responsibility. And um, I think going into the off season, just stressing that, and uh, also just uh, starting to build chemistry with the receivers and, and the rest of the team uh, going into next year, I think uh, that'll benefit us a lot. Rolo, this win will change the perception, I think, of the season that it just ended. But how much will a win here going into the spring and into the summer impact things to come next year? It's a lot of. Um, um, what do you just call that? A lot of expectations for the for the upcoming seniors next year, but it talks. It says to the local recruits, "Hey, this is one program that's gonna go high up there, so you gotta stick around." And we believe in Rolo, like we always did. Any more questions? Oh, this is funny. Co Coach Rolo, do you wanna you wanna introduce your guest to us? Uh, my name is Native. <laughs> <laughs> Just thank all of you for your support the whole uh, the whole year. Um, it's been up and down, and a lot of uh, a lot of times where these kids could have quit, and uh, they stuck together, and they did it for not only the seniors, not only the the bonds that they made, but they did it for for the fans and the supporters of of Warrior football, and. Probably most importantly, they wanted the, the alumni to, to feel good again. And um, I'm just grateful for their effort. Um, you know, I, th I thought they represented the university very well. So I'm, I'm, I'm happy for them to go out with the win tonight. I mean, we proud of the boys out there. <laughs> and we won big happy Mohana. So that's all that matters. <laughs> all right. Merry Christmas.